In this video, we're going to be taking a look at the catalog tree. So this is the catalog tree. If you by mistake close the catalog tree, you can just click on this catalog tree icon to reopen the catalog tree. And uh, you can also pin it here. Uh, sorry, you can also unpin it here. You can also pin it there. Okay, so in the catalog tree, the first thing is folder connection. So we have already gone over the folder connection and then we have the toolbox so the toolbox contains my toolbox and system toolbox so if you open our toolbox uh, let's give it a bit of while to open here we go so this is our toolbox right now if you go to system toolbox you'll see the same kind of toolboxes that are available in our toolbox so that is the system toolbox and then my toolbox actually would contain if you have made a few tool, tools yourself so i have no experience in that department so i cannot tell you more about that and then we have database servers, database, conne database connections, GIS servers, my hosted servers, ready to use servers. So these aren't actually related to the work of ArcGIS desktop. These are more of the web GIS sector. So let's just take a look at what these are, but we're not gonna, we're not gonna be using them. So we have database servers. If you go to database servers, you can add a database server. If you do a double click on that, this window will pop up and it will tell you to add a database server by typing the name of the SQL Server Express instance, uh, instance to which you want to connect. So if you type, if you write the, here is an example as well. If you give the SQL here, that uh, our catalog will connect to that server. Now, then we have database connections. Now here, you if you have connected a few databases here, then you can choose the connection from there. You have SQL servers, you have Teradata, then uh, more here. Okay, then we have GIS servers. So these are the uh, ArcGIS servers that are available here. And then you have my hosted services. If you host a service or something like that, then we have ready to use services as well. Okay. So that was it all about the catalog tree in our catalog. So thank you very much for watching. If you have found the video to be useful, please like and consider subscribing to the channel as it will enable me to make more videos like this one. Thank you.